Hello Amians, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing a DIY all natural Japanese inspired face cream. This is a rice face cream which I've been using for a while now just because my skin had a really bad flare up and I am surprised at how amazing it's made my skin. Also I've been getting so many compliments on my skin lately because I've been using really less makeup and um, so I wanted to share my secret rice cream now this rice cream is super easy to make but before i jump into the recipe make sure you've hit the subscription box below so you guys never miss a video from me and also hit that little bell icon so you guys get notified every time i do upload watch till the very very end and also hit that little thumbs up button so i know that you're enjoying my videos so i'm gonna jump straight into it it's such an easy recipe and i bet you probably have the ingredients at home but the technique of making it is a little bit different Different to my other recipes so before we start you want to soak rice in a container for at least one hour I soaked mine for about two hours so the more you soak it the softer they're gonna become and the better they're going to like pretty much cook so we're not even using the rice for the recipe we're actually using the thick liquid that's going to come out from cooking the rice so after you've soaked the rice for at least one hour we're going to put it on a pan and cook it up so when we cook it up it's going to pretty much become really mushy rice and you don't have to waste this rice you can actually keep this rice and use it for pudding i pretty much gave him to my baby to eat because you know she enjoys mashed rice so you can use the rice but we want the thick liquid that's going to come out so once you cook it for a while it's going to become thicker and thicker make sure you don't evaporate it completely you the liquid is what we actually want for our cream and when you've got the right consistency we're just going to sieve it out so i've tried this i've made this a couple of times and the sieve that I actually recommend is one of those really thin sieves that are going to just help all the liquid come out. So once I'm sieving it out, I like to use my hand and press the rice so they're just finely mashed and then they come out into the liquid. So once you've got the liquid, it's going to look something like this. Sorry. And all you need to add to this mixture to get it ready to use is aloe vera gel now the amount of um, liquid that I had was about one quarter cup of the rice liquid and I added one spoon or you can add two spoons of pure aloe vera gel I'm also adding sweet almond oil to this and also a little bit of vitamin E oil now this is a perfect night cream you can use this for up to 10 days and I personally like to store it in the fridge because every time I apply it it makes my skin so tight and like so useful and the point of using rice on your skin is because it actually gives you like really bright glowing skin rice is also great for anti-aging so if you're someone that wants to look younger and you know use anti-aging natural products this is the best thing to add to your routine rice is also rich in vitamin b and antioxidants which are great for your skin they're going to make you look so plump and youthful so when i do apply this at night after i apply it to my skin i like to just put on my face oil and that's it you don't need anything else this is jam-packed with vitamins and minerals it's all natural it's homemade and it will last you like up to two weeks i like to keep it in the fridge but you can definitely just keep it in your bathroom and it's perfect that's the consistency i just want to show you how it looks it's like such a beautiful creamy texture and that's it guys please try this cream out um i've been loving it and i know you're all going to love it once you do try it so let me know how you go if you do try it out i'd love to hear your feedback and let me know in the comments below what you want to see next thank you for watching bye